Hey y'all, aloha, it's your girl Angie. Um, I am back with my uh, second part of my vlog sale. Uh, so far, so good. Um, the pink Chanel uh, mini square flat bag is still for sale. And so is the um, Evelyn TPM in, I wanna say the e taupe color, like a grayish color. Um, that is still available, but wanna get started um, on the part two um, and pretty much the same thing if it can just be serious uh, inquiries, buyers, um, with a uh, verified PayPal account, that would be great. So without further ado, we'll just go ahead and get started. So the first item I have is uh, my Gucci Red Super Mini Marmont, and I have all the tags. And uh, this one was a tough choice because I did purchase this uh, in the Gucci store, uh, Gucci flagship store in Busan, Korea. And um, it's pretty much in in new condition and I just keep it stuffed and here's the chains uh, right here and here's the care book that got smushed by the chains um, but if you look in there it's like super clean um, and the reason why I'm selling this, y'all, is just because it's super small and it's very cute, but um, I don't reach for it. And I bought this last year and I've probably carried it maybe twice. And so I'm kind of in the thought process right now. Like, if I don't use it, then I'm going to sell it. And plus, like I told you guys in the part one, I kind of have my eyes on a, um, on a Chanel bag. And I'm kind of in the business of doing whatever I, I can to, um, to get it. So this is my red uh, super mini for sale. If you want to email me um, to talk uh, prices, please let me know. Um, and that's that. Uh, the next one is, so if you guys <laughs> have been kind of paying attention to me, I love accessories, uh, specifically iPhone cases. And every year when, the, um, when Gucci, any fashion house comes out with, a uh, case for uh, my current iPhone. I always buy it. So, uh, so far I've already sold my Louis Vuitton uh, folio for my XS Max. But unfortunately, I got to carry this thing like twice. And this is the uh, Gucci XS Max um, iPhone case. Oops. And this is pretty much brand new. So, um,. Sad to see it go. I was really going back and forth. And it's going to come with the original receipt. Um, sad to see it go, but I upgraded to the 11 Pro. So, it's no sense in me hanging on to this phone case, even though it's, it's super adorable. Um, the next item is a pre-loved item that I purchased from The Real Real. And I think I showed this a couple of times on my um, handbag collection, but... I purchased this from the real real and when I tell y'all like I have not picked this bag up like I tried to carry it like the first week that I received it last year I bought this for myself for my birthday last year and it's a pretty big bag and what I found out about myself is that I um not really a uh a, like a I'm really not feeling these chains um, on a big bag like I wish there was like that leather part that comes on the bags now at the top with the chains on the sides Or just like a bigger thicker chain. So I'm selling this bag and um, If you are interested there is like a spot right here, but it came like that um, So I think I believe this is like goat skin But if you like big bags and as you guys can see big bags are coming back in style This is like perfect. The bag is very clean in the inside um, and I thought this was awesome because it's an ideal Chanel bag for me because I like, um, I didn't like your typical flat bag. I wanted something that had the zip. So this is called like a zip top and it's perfect. Like this bag, like if you're a big bag girl, like you will love this. Like it has plenty of room. Um, like I said, the bag is super clean on the inside, no scent or anything like that. Um, and it has like, you know, just stuff, you know, little minor marks that kind of came with the bag when I purchased it. But other than that, I literally carried this bag once and just was like, this is way too big. Now, don't get me wrong. Like, I do like, um, 
it's not that I don't like bigger bags. Like I said, it's it's more of the chain thing, and um, it it gets uncomfortable for me to have such a big bag with chains. Um, but then again, I also just I like even my Neverfull has been kind of sitting for a while. And the only time I really been breaking my Neverfull out is when I'm traveling. So that's this bag, the Chanel zip uh, zip top. And uh, my Saint Laurent. So I bought this up from bought this for myself. Excuse me. About two years ago for my birthday. And this is the small kibos, uh YSL. It's in this beautiful fuchsia color. And it's such an adorable bag. But I don't reach for this bag at all. And it's for the same reason as the pink Chanel flap is because it's not practical for my life to walk around in, with pink bags and unfortunately I've had to learn the hard way as far as bags like as much as pink is my favorite color it's doing nothing for me uh, currently in my my career field so I am selling this and it comes with a strap a leather strap um, so it'll come with a strap the dust bag it does come with one of these things and it has something in the inside but it does come with this um and it'll come with this as well which is like the uh, care information and then also oh man it just fell out the extra leather piece But yeah, so this bag is like super clean on the inside as well. No markings or anything like that. The bag is beautiful and it's have like a suede um, lining and, and also fuchsia. So if you're interested, please let me know. Um, just trying to get rid of some stuff, free up some room in my closet. Um, And the uh, hardware is gold, and it's really pretty. I mean, you can't really go wrong with a pink and gold bag. And it looks like out of, I think only one, only this prong does not have the stickers still on it. So it does still have the stickers on all of these except that one. So kind of let you know that I really don't carry this bag much. So that's that. So St. Laurent, and they'll come with all of that stuff that you just seen. And for my last, I'm very torn about this, but we're here. So um, this one, y'all, you're going to be super shocked. Um, so I was like literally tracking this item down all over the place and finally received it. Um, and realized that it was just too big. And I... It's heavy when it gets big, or sorry, it's heavy when it gets big, excuse me. It's heavy when it gets full. And I like stuff like my little toiletry bags. So without further ado, and this is like the receipt. So you will get the receipt. Um, I'm the original owner. I'm the, I'm the original owner of my, uh, all my things except the big Chanel bag in the back. But the big Chanel bag um, in the back does come with its... Um, with its uh, authentic, authen, authenticity card, excuse me, authenticity card. And it also comes with like a document from, excuse me, it comes with the receipt that I have from the real real. Um, so let you know that, you know, they authenticated it as well. Um, so yeah, so back to this item, so we're here, this is the original box, and it is a brand new toiletry 19. And I thought I was gonna love this. This is made in Spain. I thought I was gonna love it. And like I said, like I put all my stuff in here and I was like, um, yeah, I'm not, sorry, not brand new, I'm sorry y'all. I use this um, trying to see if I would actually like it um, and as beautiful as it is and I try to use it as a clutch I'm just not a clutch girl so 
I actually am very much a top handle or a tote girl. And if Louis Vuitton would make something like this that had handles, whoo, I would be all over it, okay? Um, and you guys are probably going to be like, they do, Angie, calm down. But you know what I mean. Like, this is super cute. So if I there was just like two little gold chains that I could just kind of like hold it with, that would be super, super cute. So yeah, so email me if you're interested in this. Um, comes with all the stickers and stuff like that. And dust bag and box and bag. The bag is in my closet. So, but yeah, y'all, that is everything that I'm selling right now in this part two um, of my vlog sale. So please let me know if you're interested. Um, I apologize for getting on here so late. I was supposed to make another video a couple days ago, like back to back, but I've been super tired. And as you guys can probably see, I am like exhausted. So um, just let me know. Mahalo.